Hey everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Hearts of Iron 4 Millennium Dawn Modern Day Mod Playthrough as France. And uh, where we left off, we are in a bit of a pickle, but now even more so because um, we're now fighting India and Turkmenistan. I don't know how it happened, but it happened. And we're here now. Um, but in better news, we're about to have some fun. <laughs> Enable all of these attacks. And we are going to watch everything fall. Enjoy, my lovelies. Yeah, I'm just going to... I'm just going to sit here in silence. And just let you enjoy watching my tanks go at it. Because it's quite a beautiful sight. Like, I really have to... Put it out there how much of a beautiful sight... This... This really is. Look at it. We're just absolutely bulldozing. Quebec has crumbled... Uh, we just need to get the last of Canada. That should be, you know, easy enough. Just line it up there. Finish the job. Thank you very much, chap. Have some fun whilst you're at it. But, um... America has fallen, guys. America has fallen. We can finally move forward. Now it's just a matter of time of piecing out the Indians. That is going to be a task in itself. And to do that, we're going to have to go through Pakistan, I think. Because there's no other way to get to them. Ah, Quebec. Uh, let's just quickly take all states. Because Quebec was ours. Um, to be fair, I'm going to take all of Canada. Yeah, because technically French, although this was British over here, most of Canada was French before the Seven Years' War. So I'm going to take all of Canada. I'm going to take all of Canada for myself. Let's do that. <laughs> but just let it happen. Let it happen and have fun with it. Uh, speaking of having fun, there's a little land bridge right here. So um, I want you to actually pop down and take that. And you three just go in and absolutely bulldoze them. Happy days! Couldn't be happier. <laughs> you know, guys, I've really got to admit, seeing how quickly these tanks are just steamrolling it through the US, this really is very satisfying to watch on a map. I have to admit, it's very aesthetically pleasing, as it were. Who, who knew Blitzkrieg was such fun? <laughs> oh, it's good stuff, though. Just watching it is really pleasing. The Americans should crumble any second, though. We, we've pretty much taken everything from them. There's not much left to do. At all. It's literally just a matter of time. Where is the capital? Oh, we've taken the capital. There you go. The US is cap. Bish, bash, bosh. Thank you very much for playing, America. It's been fun. Now we need to deal with this. Yeah, this is not going to be easy. And I'm probably going to have to go through Pakistan as well, which I'm not looking forward to in the slightest I've got tank divisions that are doing nothing as well. Like, where, what What are you doing? What? what? Mm. Right, okay, look, guys, 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 guys. There's no America anymore. Let's go put a stop to India, please. Let's get moving. Are you on the move? You're on the move. That's that's fantabulous. I'm glad you're kind of contributing. What? Why, why are you not moving? Why are you not moving? Is it? Ah, oh, it's because we've got no way to get there. Right, well, I suppose it's time to kill Turkey as well then, isn't it? Right, let's uh, let's deal with the Turks. Righto, guys, righto. It's time to declare war on the Turks, just as well since India now have a foothold here in the Middle East, which is not good for us. Their navy's giving us a hard time. I'm going to lose the majority of my divisions here. And my ships, for whatever reason, still cannot leave. Like, if I maybe if I set the that as, as, as the home base, will that do it for them? No, nope, even then. Even then, I have no idea what the bloody hell is wrong with these ships. But, um, for some reason, they're fully org, they're fully strength, they've got everything. But they just don't want to leave. I, I, I don't get it. I genuinely do not get it. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I have no idea what the bloody hell is going on. Oh, well, well, we'll see. We'll see. Right, anyway, let's, uh, without further ado, go after the Turks. We've got the tanks on mission. Everything should be fine and dandy. I'll quickly send the tanks in now just to clean up Adana. Uh, all the seven provinces just like this. And, uh, yeah, we should be good. We should be good. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Although Ankara right now is being nuked, I believe that is the end for Turkey and potentially India as well. Uh, we're about to push all the way through. We've got our super tanks on it. Uh, hopefully there shouldn't be a worry in the world. We do have control here. 
albeit outnumbered, we do have control in the area of Turkmenistan for the moment. So I'm going to try and force through a surrender if I can. So I want these guys to come through like that. These guys to come through like that. Whilst we got the dominance, let's use it to our best ability. We need to finish India. All that remains... like I can get India now. That means I don't have to go for them later when they're stronger. And then I can... From, from, from India, just province hop over to Cambodia, Laos, and Vietnam. And I'm good. And I'd be good after that. That's literally it. That's all I need. Oh, no, that's a lie. Sorry, I need Madagascar. All the little islands. Madag I'm not going to bother with the little islands. I'll get Madagascar, but not the little ones. And then other than that, like Francophone France, yeah, I could count Zaire, but we all know the Congo is technically Belgian, not French, although they speak French. So, but at the end of the day, I've got my main territories. I just need to get the Caribbean territories, which I think I already have. And then Madagascar and parts of India. And I'm good. I'm finished. This campaign will be done. Oh, God. Everything's slowly coming to a close, isn't it? It's, it's sad, but heartwarming at the same time. How? I have no idea. Your guess is as good as mine. Um, there we go. Kirkuk, Baghdad, Kut, into Amra, into Naziri, N N Naziria, 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 into Basra. Boom. Done. Get it done, get it done, get it done, done, done. Box them in when you go around. Then that should be a nice cheeky little encirclement like that. Boom. Done. They're dead. There we go. That's a nice that's a nice little encirclement. And then you guys too. Just wipe out a good 13 of their divisions there as well. And uh, every, everything's hunky-dory at that point. <laughs> and that, ladies and gentlemen, is a successful deterrent of India in the Middle East. We managed to redeem that back and pull it back. Um, whether or not it'd be wise to go for Iran, probably not. Uh, let's look at finishing the Turkmen. It's real ricky tick. Uh, how are we looking here? Uh, have I still got dominance? Oh no, it's debated now. It's debated. Right, we need to get more fighters in. Let's get more multi rolls in and then we should be good. We just need uh, 200 of them. Oh, no, I've got a little bit over the limit there. <laughs> there we go. That's the airspace secured once again. Let's uh, do a little bombing run when things get better. And then we'll finally, finally put an end to the Turkmenis. And all that's left is potentially steamrolling through Pakistan and getting to India. So that's going to be fun. Right, see you in a bit. Radio, ladies and gentlemen, that is that. Turkmenistan has capitulated. We can finally take back this land. Now, I'm actually going to do something a little different here. I'm not going to take Turkmenistan for myself. I'm actually going to give it to a good, good friend of mine who I think probably deserves it for their sacrifice during this war so far. I'm going to give it to Iraq. And I accidentally screwed that up. Hold on. Give me one minute and everything will be Iraqi. Give me one moment. Oh my god. The oil. Oh, the oil. <laughs> and there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is the peace deal. Turkey and Turkestan are now parts of French Imperial Iraq. The Afghani Kingdom is back under us as a puppet. Which means it's now time to develop everything. We will not idly stand by and let the Indians get away with this. Oh, no, 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 no. Now is the time to buck up and give them a good old-fashioned ass whooping. Right, uh, let's go plus five because that. Just make sure we've got all the infrastructure in the world being fed into it. Fantastic. Put them right to the very top. Like so. And feed that all in. Wonderful. Now we just need to kill India, and to get to India, we need to get to Pakistan. We're going to be making our life a lot harder than what it needs to be, but to get the job done, we must do what we must. Rocket artillery, start researching that just because. Um, I also need to do in anti-tank upgrade that, fantastic. Get rid of the French Imperial troops that I do not need. Oh, sorry, German Imperial troops. And now it's just a matter of time, but it'll be a matter of time in the next episode so i'll see you guys there thank you very much for watching if you have enjoyed don't forget to of course click that like button and all subscribe share with friends that grow for the channel all that fun stuff and i'll see you next time laters